What is going on, my super sandwiches? Romsa here with my messed up here, and today we'll play some more Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. And today we're gonna be attempting to get what is this, this little guy? Oh, he just curl. This is my life. This is absolutely my life. This is what I have to deal with every single day I wake up. It's just, just. Ugh. I gotta get a haircut. That's exactly what I do. I gotta get a haircut uh, to fix this annoyingness. If my hair is more wild than uh, I have no analogy. That's how wild it is. <laughs> Whatever. Well. We'll, we'll leave the hair as this right now, but for now, we are going to be going back into the Buhan Summons. In case you didn't know, which I'm sure everybody knows at this point, because I've made so many videos about this. Uh, Buhan has descended upon the Dokkan world in the Japanese side, and uh, we're trying to pull, not him, we want Janimba. Janimba's the one we want, I've been waiting for this card to come back in JP for a long time, and I want him. Uh, why? I don't know. I don't even, I'm not even going to use him, because my current team right now does not even need a Janimba, but... He's still cool. I love how you know he can reduce damage by a lot. There's gonna be situations where I probably would need to use Janimba in certain boss fights, so he's actually a great card to go with. With that said, I need to pull him first, so that's kind of what we're going for. Now, Buhan's cool. My only problem with Buhan is is I, he's not that great compared to Super Vegito. There's probably gonna be a lot of you know talk and conversation going on about him, but he's not. Super Vegito is still absolutely superior to him, which is ironic because he was superior to him in the show. Here's a super attack. Uh, what he does is, is he is a nuker, and for every single orb on top of like increasing damage by like 12%, Buhan also gains 3000 HP. The Awakened version, this is the non-Awakened version obviously, but that's what he does. He heals and nukes, so it's cool, kind of. Uh, honestly, what I think they should have done is, is because uh, his super attack changes based on a super attack level, what they should have done is, is when he does the Super Ghost Kamikaze Kamehameha attack, it should do attack all. That would have been great. That would be a great addition, because like after I believe uh, Super Attack 6 or 7, the later half of his uh, Super Attack levels, he has like a 30% chance to do Super Ghost Kamikaze attack, which does a lot of damage. They should have done it, if he does that, it's attack all. That would be a nice little, little extra gimmick there, because I mean, you do make a bunch of Super Ghost Kamikazes. They should have done that. They should have done that, just as a little bonus. Uh, but for now, he's not that great, but if I pull Janimba, I would want Buhan as well, because they, they kind of go together, they're both N-types. So that's kind of where I'm at with that. All right. Now, I've been keeping up my videos this past week. I pulled nothing. And this is my I'm going insane face. <laughs> so maybe, maybe this video today is going to be the one. This is probably going to be the one where I get something decent. So let's see. Let's see what happens. Let us see what happens, shall we? All right. We're going to start off with this exact same Goku that I started off with yesterday. Great. Fantastic. <sighs> oh gosh, I, I I love Dokkan. Dokkan is just it. There, there's like a certain excitement you get when you do these summons that only Dokkan can do. You know, I've been playing a lot of Naruto Ultimate Blazing this past week, and while I love the combat system in it, there's something that the game is missing, and I can't figure out what it is. There's something about it that's not as uh, effective on me as it was with Hunter Hunter Battle All Stars and Dokkan. It's the most fun game out of all of them. I love the system. You know, and I already have Gara and I have Kakashi on my on my game. Um, and who else do I have? I have the the five star Naruto, and I have Neji. So those are like my my rare cards. Uh, and having those, I I don't feel like like I'm fulfilled. Maybe what what I need in uh, Ultimate Ninja Blazing is I need to wait for more cards to come out because I've always been a bigger fan of Shippuden than I was of Naruto, the original series. So maybe like once you get to the part uh, where it's all overpowered characters, like they start introducing like the Rinnegan Sasuke, for example, or even uh, you know Kurama mode Naruto, maybe then I'll be more hype about it. But for now, I'm kind of like it's, I'm I'm missing something, and I think it's just the fact that I was never not a big fan of the Naruto series as well as of Shippuden. So I'll play it, but it's just this game. When you when you do something in this game, it's more exciting, a lot more exciting. All right, what we got? Another rainbow SSR uh, despair, SS despair, SS despair. That's what it is. And we got Piccolo. It's like uh, the Naruto game has this thing called Keep Together Naruto, where when you do a summon animation, Sasuke jumps in, helps with you. Now, if you're doing a summon and Sasuke jumps in like midway through, it's usually guaranteed to be like a very rare or a super rare card. Whereas in, uh, if he jumps in at the beginning, it's like, keep, let's keep it together, Naruto. It's like, oh, stop, this is going to be a good card. And it ends up being a rare, and it's like, oh, this trolled me. 
That's what the rainbow uh, animation is in Dokkan. It's the equivalent to what we have in Naruto over there. Um, yeah. Okay. I don't even want to press this. I, I, I don't want to press this. I had 380 stones this past week. 380 stones. Out of those 380 stones, I pulled one SSR, which is Tech Vegito. Which, it's a great card. It's awesome. This is going to be a good card. Uh, it's, a, it's a great card. The only reason why I'm not as excited about it is because I have to awaken it first before I can feed it to my current one. Swipe! Ooh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, keep going. Yeah, I have to awaken it first. So I have to fight Super Vegito six times, I believe. Great. Chao Tzu. Yeah, this is gonna be a good card, right there. This gonna be good. <sighs> yeah. Uh, so what was I saying? Oh yeah, the Tech Vegito is cool. Uh, he's a great support card. He gives a bunch of key to my uh, fusion cards. He uh. I don't even use them anymore, to be honest, just because I've been running a mono AGL team. Um, but I, I I can't feed them until I awaken them. I hate that I have to awaken uh, a card to a transcendent UR first before I can feed it to another transcendent UR. Like, it'd be great if I could just straight up feed it. Like, oh yeah, here you go. At least give me 50%. Right now, if I try to feed my SSR um, Tech Vegito, it's a 5% chance. And I believe that also is if, I, if he is a... Uh, you are as well. I believe it's still 5%, but I might be wrong. Either way, I hate the fact that I have to awaken the first to feed it. And, uh, yeah. If I didn't have to do it, I'd be excited. Like, oh, yeah, Super Attack 3. But now I'm just kind of like, nye. Nye. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. <sighs> oh, gosh. I just, I, can't, I just can't wait to move. I'm moving, folks. I said this a thousand times this past week. I still get people who tweet me every single day. Like, oh, how, how, did you move? I'm like, no, no, no. I'm still moving. The thing is, is what I'm trying to do right now is, is I'm trying to pre-record as much as possible. And you know what's funny? You could tell that the rare cards were all drawn by like the amateurs of the team. At least my theory is because all the rare cards have awful art. Like this is crap. This is crap. Like I mean, let's look for a second. Let's go back into the card section. Let's look at the card section. So let's look at a rare. Where's the rare? Let's look at. Uh, do I have any rares? I have no rares. Seriously. Oh, so I've been pulling SSRs the entire time. Okay, whatever. Let's look at this Piccolo. Look how awful this Piccolo is. Like, no offense to the artist, but like, you see this Piccolo, and then you see this Piccolo right here. Where's the other Piccolo? Piccolo! Piccolo! Where's Piccolo? Where's the other Piccolo? Great, not him. That's not Piccolo. Um, Can I... Can this game not right now? It should be in this section. I feel like I... I oh, there he is. This one. Look at the art on this Piccolo. A lot better! Now, I assume it's planned because, you know, obviously, the, SR, the SSRs, you want the art to be awesome. You want the art to be incredible. So when you get, like, the cards that uh, are just regular SRs that no one cares about, it's like... It's like fan art, basically. It's like, yeah, you know, you, you can draw this for me. This, this is fine. I mean, it's not bad. It's just when you compare the rares to SRs to SSRs, there's a huge difference. And, and then you have this guy. I don't even know why this guy even exists. Okay, back to the summons. Here we go. Let's see what we can do this time. Let's see what we can do with the remaining despair that I have inside my soul. It's like, oh, damn it. I'm charging up my despair. That's what's happening. It's, 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 I'm charging up like a spirit bomb. See, that's rare. There it is. Uh, and when I collect enough despair points, I'm going to get that amazing card. That's kind of like the situation. Like, look look how bad the art is on. Well, this is not bad art. Okay, so this Chi Chi's not that bad. Um. Also, I've noticed like the earlier cards, all the earlier cards have like the, the, the bad art. The newer cards all are nicer. That's why there's, a, there's also a difference too. I'm not trying to knock the artist. I'm just kind of pointing out, you know, how I feel as a fan of the series. <sighs> and right now how I feel as a fan of the series is just pure despair. This, this is what Yamcha feels like. This is, this is exactly how Yamcha must have felt in the entire series. Just, just sadness and despair. And just, ugh. Come on. All right, what we got? Can we get something good? Hercule on the left. Give me that good luck. Let me get that good luck. Let me get that good luck. Here we go. Watch this be a Super Saiyan 3 or 2. Just because uh, Hercule on the left has always given me good luck. Personally. It's given me personal good luck. This time. No, not this time. This time I just have that. That's, see, even that. Like, the art's kind of like. No, you know what? That art's nice. That art's nice. I can't hang on that. I can't handle that one. It does look a little pixelated, though. But I, I can't handle that card. All right. Come on, man. Come on, Dokkan gods. What you got for me? Nothing. Literally nothing. Okay. I don't even want to see this. I don't even care. Don't care. Don't care. I don't, I don't want this crap. I don't want it. 
Damn it! I was trying to do like reverse psychology, so I can be like, "Oh snap! I do want it." No, I actually, I, I <laughs> could you not, Videl? Could you please not? That'd be great if you could not. That, 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 I'd be great if Videl could just not right now. One, two, two pods. Okay. The last summon of the day is going to be a group summon, so get ready. Um, I apologize, my despair is kind of like kicking in, but we will still get together and do our summon. So pause me if you need to, if you need to prepare. And then unpause me and uh, yeah, let's do this. Here we go. Final summon of the video is going to be an epic group summon. You guys are going to get cool cards. I'm going to get crap because he got Hercule on the right side. That's just how this works. Um, yeah. On the count of three. One, two, three. Swipe. Hey, at least we got Super Saiyan. At least we got Super Saiyan, so it's going to be an SR. The question is, is an SR what caliber? Is it going to be an SR like Bukalo? Or is it going to be, no, it's going to be Baby. Okay. Wow. This is the despair arc. This is absolutely the despair arc. But that's okay because apparently you guys love it when I get bad pulls. So there you go. Take all the despair despair. Hopefully, hopefully you got the luck in the game. So. Yeah, yeah. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you leave a like button below. Any questions, comments, feedback, summons, drop them down below. Tweet me at Ryan Style. Share your polls as well. Over there, and for now, I guess, um, yeah, I'm gonna go do another video. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoy the rest of the day, and I'll see you all your awesome super sandwiches in the comment section below. Peace.